everyone, it's Jennifer. I'm here with a Dollar Tree haul for you. Um, I'm actually going to break it up into three again. It seems to be a little bit easier, and I'm hoping it'll have a better flow to it. And I'm also hoping, I know someone who brought up that my voice kind of goes in and out during the video, and I think it's because I'm working in such a small space. And I'm having to turn to grab stuff behind me and I'm not thinking about it. I turn my head away from the camera and so it's not picking me up. So I'm going to try and do it this way, see if it's a little bit easier. I'm hoping over the summer that I'll be able to um, work on getting my craft space set up the way I want to. And hopefully being able to create a space where I can do videos. I miss doing them in front of the camera. But right now, like, I can't find my tripod. I really don't have a space to do it. So that's definitely something I'm going to work on. All right, so for the first part of the video, this is going to be pretty much, like, food kind of items. So let me get into that. All right, I know this is dog food, but I went ahead and included it in there. This is the Snack and Bone 2-Pack and the Lamb and Rice Flavor um, Treats for Dogs. These are going to be for my two dogs that are outside. Um, and I thought this was kind of cool. It's on the label if it'll pick up brush direct incorporated pet products a wbenc certified certified woman owned business so i don't know I've, I've just been seeing a lot of stuff like that recently um i thought it was kind of cool but this says helps control plaque and tartar through chewing through chewing action i was gonna say through chewing gum I don't know. but anyways i grabbed that for them for as a little treat. My daughter wanted some bubble gum. So this is the pack she picked out with the strawberry, the bubble gum flavor, or two strawberries and one bubble gum flavor. Uh, we are trying really, really hard to get back to our low carb. Um, after the holidays, like we did kind of okay during the holidays, but it was really afterwards. I don't know what happened, but we just started to struggle so hard. And so one big thing I've been working with my doctor with is I was having some problem with fatigue and just lack of energy and however you want to call it but um so I went there got some blood work done got some results um really good as far as it's what I'm going through is definitely treatable and can be you know improved so working with that and um just trying to get back onto the low carb um anyway so I found some items that we can have some new stuff. Um, I found these Pampa Pink Salmon Fillets, the smoke flavored and soybean oil, wild caught, skinless, and boneless. And here's the nutritional information. They are one carb, but then you get one dietary fiber. And um, so that makes them, we count them as zero carbs for one can. So I thought me and my husband would try those. They only had two of them. They also had mussels, clams, and oysters. I don't know. I don't know if I have the, if I'm brave enough to try those. So, I mean, like, I love seafood, pretty much all seafood, but I just don't know about that. All right, these are for my daughter. These are the Brunswick tuna salad with crackers. This is, they have the other brand, um, is it Star Tuna? I don't know. But this is actually her favorite. She's tried both of them, but this is her favorite brand. So she picked up two of those to have as snacks. I picked up one of these bitty jars of Pace picante in the medium just to have um there's nutritional information just to have to add to things it is two carbs for two tablespoons but again you know we don't use a whole lot at a time all right these are one of my husband's favorites to have to take to work along with his peanuts these are the sausages there's nutritional information on that. They're one carb per serving, and you get two servings in a can, so they're two carbs for a whole can, which is not bad at all. So I picked them up six of those. These were new, and I was really excited to find these. Are these little bottles of Frank's Red Hot? No, that's not it. There it is. There's nutritional information on those, so zero carbs. Um, I don't mind these little bottles. I don't know if they are you know, any better deal than the full size, like in the grocery store, but we don't use a whole lot at a time. I may put a little bit on my plate for like, if I have some chicken or something. And so, um, these are a great size for me. They are dated March 19th, 2019. So I'll probably put one in the cupboard and one in the fridge and they will be perfect for that. And then along those lines, I also found two of these small bottles of A1, um, these are five ounces. The Frank's Red Hot is five ounces too. So, 
Again, same idea. These are dated October 2019. These are, there's a nutritional label. These are three carbs. Um, but again, I don't use them that often. And with a lower carb meal, it kind of works out. So I grabbed those. That is it for my food haul. I'm going to go ahead and stop it here. And then I will continue with the rest of the stuff. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you have a great day. Bye.